Hi, this is John. Today is uh, Thursday, June 23rd. I'm just giving you all a quick little update. Um, tomorrow, the 24th, I'm going in for my uh, pre-op visit to my doctor, and then I'll be going over to the hospital after that uh, and meeting with the anesthesiologist. Um, and uh, then once I'm done with that, I'm going to return back to work. Uh, next Wednesday is my surgery at 10 o'clock. And uh, I'm excited. I'm, I'm hoping it's going to go really well. I'm looking forward to all the benefits. Um, today I ran into a person at work. I, d I didn't know this until today that she also had um, uh, weight loss surgery and uh, made tremendous strides and improvements in her life. So um, there's a couple of things going on. Uh, uh, I've been working on my diet. I've not been as good as I should have been. But um, I'm doing what I can. Uh, I've lost about nine pounds, and I'm hoping when I weigh in tomorrow, I'll be uh, at that 10 pound mark. If I'm not, I'm not going to sweat it. I'm fairly certain they're going to put me on a liquid diet starting tomorrow until next Wednesday when they perform the surgery. Um, and uh, what else? Um, uh, trying to stay positive. You know, I've talked to some people, I'm not really sharing this with a whole lot of people that I'm going to, going to have weight loss surgery. Uh, some are very supportive, some not so much. Um, you know, everybody views things in their own mind, and uh, a lot of people, I'm 238 pounds, as, uh, well, probably 239 uh, since lunch. But anyway, um, when I weighed in a couple weeks ago, I was 249 pounds. People have no reference. All the people who know me now do not know me when I was lean and healthy. My lean and healthy weight was around 150 pounds, between 145 and 150, which is right where I expect to be back after the surgery and several months of, of uh, living with the new me. Um, if I don't get all the way down to 140 pounds, if I only lose so, you know, most of the weight, but not all of it, I mean, if I get down around 160, I'll be perfectly happy. Um, but I think with the exercise that I that I do and I will be continuing to do, um, I think I'm going to have some really good results here. Uh, the person I talked to today um, at work, when I found out that she had um, gastric bypass surgery, she was telling me she didn't tell her family at all. She started telling them and got so much negative feedback um, she didn't want to kill her spirit, and she just decided not to tell them until after the surgery, about two weeks after the surgery. And um, she's lost well over 150 pounds and looks fabulous. Uh, so she was telling me to stay strong spiritually, mentally, and uh, don't let the naysayers turn you away from what could be some serious positive life-changing effects as a result of the surgery. So that's where I'm at. I'm just taking you know what people say with a grain of salt and... Um, listen to the people who have actually had the surgery <laughs> and have had tremendous positive results. So that's what I'm focusing on. Uh, um, and we'll take it from there. Um, one last thing is I'll probably stand up and show you what I look like. I'm not huge in as far as uh, the amount of fat. Well, but to me, this seems to be, I'm just one of those people that's very compact and dense. Still, I'm still close to 100 pounds overweight I was when I first started this journey so here's one body shot I'm not huge for a man this is what needs to go with all this and then just it's accumulated on me all over my body but this is not the real me this is a fat vest that I can't take off that I intend to get rid of through weight loss surgery well, that's it for today, folks. Uh, if there's anything earth-shattering or really interesting that I find out tomorrow after my pre-op, I will make another little interim video before my surgery and say hello and share it with you. If not, I will probably make another video after my surgery. Anyway, guys, hope you have a great weekend, and uh, take care.